I'm gonna pause here, I'm gonna lose the script, and I'm gonna reflect on the recurring feeling I have of impending doom. U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention Director Dr. Rochelle Walensky on Monday made an emotional plea for Americans to take precautions to prevent the spread of COVID-19 amid an increase in cases across the country. And I'm calling on every single one of you to sound the alarm, to carry these messages into your community and your spheres of influence. We do not have the luxury of inaction. For our, the health of our country, we must work together now to prevent a fourth surge. The United States surpassed 30 million total cases of COVID-19 on Sunday, and the seven-day average of new cases was slightly less than 60,000 per day, which represented a 10% increase compared with the prior seven-day period. U.S. President Joe Biden announced on Monday increased availability for vaccinations nationwide. I'm pleased to announce that at least 90 percent of all adults in this country will be eligibly vaccinated by April the 19th, just three weeks from now, because we have the vaccines. For the vast, vast majority of adults, you won't have to wait till May 1. The president added that despite the vaccine rollout, it was too early to ease up on precautions. Each of us has to do our part. We have an obligation, patriotic obligation. Wash your hands. Stay socially distanced. Wear a mask as recommended by the CDC. And get vaccinated. Now is not the time to celebrate. This all comes as the U.S. government has hit the accelerator on its vaccine shipments, allowing states to finish vaccinating priority groups and open shots to all adults in the coming weeks. The companies making the three authorized COVID-19 vaccines have committed to providing the U.S. government with 240 million doses by Wednesday.